Hi everyone, Clayton speaking. Uh, this is just a quick hobby update of what I've been doing in the past couple of days. Um, I've been doing the shields for my Revenant Titan. Uh, that's the inside of them, just doing that blue glow. I'll just um, probably just leave it like that because they're going to be sort of hard up against the legs anyway. So it just gives the, um, gives the impression of a, like a glowing shield kind of thing. Um, now, yeah, this is... This is the one I had painted in the browns, but I've changed it. So, um, I don't know if you can pick up the visual effect on the camera. Oh, there it goes, yeah. So if you sort of look at it long enough, it sort of, it starts to become 3D. It looks like raised sections. Um, I did the gemstones a little bit weird on it as well. That's all freehand. Um, so you can see it's a little bit, a little bit messy in places, but you get that. That's a good angle of it. So yeah, just did some sort of blackish gemstones, that sort of Geiger feel to just keep it, keep that Geiger feel sort of punching along. And then this one here, I sort of really went to town on. Um, just the biomech tendrils. Uh, the gemstones I did fairly similar to the chest one on my Wraith Knight. Um, and what else have I done? Just those little, these little bits here. Just sort of gives it that, um, I don't know, that impression of sort of flesh, a kind of weird alien sort of style flesh sort of thing. Um, did some dribbly bits at the top there, and the tendrils. Uh, the light's sort of picking it up a bit weird there, but you get the idea. So yeah, I'm really happy with them. Uh, I think they turned out pretty wicked. So um, the Titan is going to be a long term deal now I was going to do it fairly basic just with the blacks and the bones and whatnot like the bone shields and everything but given the fact that I've gone this stupid on the shield I suppose I better do the rest of it so it's got all the uh, all the biomech crap all over it um, I know it kind of sounds like I don't want to do it I do it's going to be wicked but I can just foresee the amount of work that I'm going to have to do on it and how long it's going to take me, but given that I don't play 40k anymore, I suppose it doesn't really matter. It'll get done when it gets done. And plus, I've got um, I've got six miniatures, other people's miniatures. Um, three are for commission, and three are for my um painting competition. So, um, yeah, if anyone's keen on me painting up a general or a vehicle or you know like a hero character or something as a commission give me a yell because I might start just dabbling in that sort of thing um, price wise I don't really know what to charge or whatever but um, we'll work that out on an individual basis if you can so give me a yell and just do all the normal youtubery things so cheers guys thanks for watching bye